Hey everybody, Greater here again with another episode of Dungeon of the Endless. Uh, I'm getting really nervous, it might be the last episode of Dungeon of the Endless. Um, we lost two people last round. Really crazy. Guess we're gonna have to see how we do. Hopefully we make it through. Uh, but let's jump right into it. So, here we are guys, floor 7, it's pretty high up there, and unfortunately only two heroes. <laughs> pretty nervous, definitely have to play this pretty slow and very safe. I guess we're going to kind of see what happens. Um, but yeah, I guess we, no time like the present, I guess we shall move Forward is uh, the only thing we really can do. First room looks good. Nothing's murdering us yet. <laughs> Guess we're gonna get that energy generation started right away because we're gonna have to place a lot of turrets down. We're gonna actually start right now. I'll move forward. The reason I placed all these down is I don't know when we're gonna face enemies. Like, and honestly, we go for it. I haven't got punished yet, and that one was worth it, like a lot. And the more rooms we can light, honestly, the better. Then we don't have to worry about getting murdered. Who's gonna be next? Just because uh, we're gonna have to level up these guys so we don't run into anybody new. That's nice. Uh, just kind of worried I might have to actually power this room with the room thing, but it's actually a magical one, so it's automatically powered, which works in my favor. Hmm. I think we'll upgrade the dust field generator. Because that buffs defense for the room, which I think will help quite a bit. <clears throat> this sucks, because this is a waste of a room, basically. And we found the exit room. <laughs> We're actually gonna open the door here because this has already got defenses built in. I need to place down a science generator. This is a good room for it if I have enough dust. Perfect, and I got a friend of the right, and that's awesome. I don't think anyone uses a gun. Well, she does actually, I'm pretty sure. <coughs> uh, but a big gun, this one won't work. Now the real question is, which room am I going to not power? <laughs> yes, let's put her down here and turn that one off so I can turn this one on. We can get our science generator down. Kind of just hoping I find another hero, really. I think we're actually going to put some mechanical pals around the food replicator, because uh, if we find someone, we're going to need to like boost their level quite a bit. Uh, we can't afford to waste a bunch of resources right now. Now we haven't faced off anybody yet, but I'm sure that's gonna happen pretty soon. I place a couple more defenses down. Hopefully that stops them a little bit. It's 
not very expensive, so I might as well do it. Gives a huge, huge def uh, buff, so. <clears throat> NPCs are not a enemies, by the way. Uh, they're just features. Well, that's that. We exploited this whole entire half. Um, guess we'll have to keep her down there for now. This room is the only room that's gonna spawn waves of enemies. Uh, this is kind of nerve-wracking, because <laughs> enemies could be in this room, and I might not be able to fend them off. They're not, thank god. <laughs> oh, that's nice. So, <laughs> that's not good at all. That brings me down my attack power, gives monsters 50% less defense, but also I take more damage and a bunch of negative stuff. That sucks. I think I'm gonna have to probably do is just build up these rooms down here. Down. Doing a research. I don't have enough to power of those rooms. And I have to keep my research rooms powered. Pepper spray. Mm, target monster attacks other monsters. That's actually not too bad, probably. Overheating. That's nice too. 15% attack power. Probably research that, because I think that could be a pretty helpful. A little boost if we're in the same room. <coughs> Just kind of hoping I run into uh, some more dust so I can power some more rooms here, but it's not happening. That's bad. That's a really bad guy. And we got waves spawning below as well. Hopefully my turrets can handle that. They're already past my first defense. Not looking good. Oh, okay, my turrets handled it. Whew. Let me put another hollow hero in here. Well, I got enough to power another room. That's plus. I just don't know where I should put it. I mean, I guess I kind of have to put it ahead so I can explore further. Defense! All here. I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't. I kind of need more, like, attack power. I don't... Just claim more mine just doesn't seem to be that... Good. I mean, it's only level one, too. Just kind of like making a room where I don't have to, uh, can, I can kind of buff my guys. So, I mean, I'm gonna start encountering more monsters and more monsters. That's nice. That's a power room. Plus, this room's automatically just running. And of course, more bad guys. Whew. Still doing okay. Looks like everything's holding up. More dust I can collect from in here. Gives me enough to power another room. That's amazing. <laughs> I only have to worry about guys coming from this way now. Ooh, okay, so far so good. Yes, we'll keep adventuring. 
bathroom with nothing, so that sucks. <laughs> Get down, her down to research. Plot down some more prisoner prods, because it really doesn't do us, cost us really anything to not do that, because we make 15 a turn. Divide the defense of monsters in the same room by two, so that's nice because it does way more damage to them. I think we'll probably do tear gas one. And like, just really need something to slow them down so that the turrets can do damage. back up here. I think we're still doing okay. We're really still pretty nervous. <laughs> Got like so many turrets down. I didn't really need to watch my numbers too. I guess I can level them up a bit. <laughs> 200 food. Master Hacker. It's a whip plus 8 for repairing. That's really a super high wit now. I'm gonna save the other stuff for healing because you never know how much I'm gonna have to spam that really. Okay. Alright. The next room. I have to worry about monster spamming here now too. There's a couple there. They're getting taken care of pretty quickly, so that's good. Uh, I'm not really worried about letting monsters spawn down here. It's going to take some of the heat off of up here. So I'm going to continue to let them spawn here, mainly because I have two full rooms of defenses, which should help a little bit, plus this room. It, this is kind of what I'm worried about here, just because they, they'll just uh, kill all the stuff in this room. Uh, this is kind of like my final, final pushback. If anything, I'll take this room away again to power another room over here, but not unless I absolutely have to. Kind of just really hoping to find another guy, because that'll just make my life quite a bit easier. Another item! Not awful, but it doesn't help that much. <laughs> what does the tool belt do? It's a nice item, actually. Extra wit. So. She, don't have, uh, she doesn't have one, so we'll equip her with that. So they're very smart. That's very good, so if I actually end up finding a couple others, uh, that'll help me out a little bit. Huh, merchant's not a terrible thing, probably. Too bad that doesn't give me a whole lot of anything. It gives me another room. I can't afford any of this stuff, unfortunately. I don't have, I don't have enough. I don't have enough dust. I can't afford it. 